Hi there, Trevor Duncan again with Cell Seattle and CellSeattle.com, buyers of used cell phones. And this time we're going to be doing some procedures on how to hard reset the T Mobile G2 in the case that it has become locked and you do not remember your code. So here we can see that this person has locked their G2 and we try multiple combinations and it does not allow us to access the phone. So there is a way to get around that. And the first thing that we need to do is we need to shut the phone all the way off. So to do so, we've got the power key on the top here. We need to hold that down for just a few seconds. Ask if we want to power off. Yes, we do. Okay. So the phone is shutting down. And now we're going to be using the hardware keys to perform the master reset. Here it's shutting down now. And again the reason you would want to do this is if your phone, if you have your pattern lock and you've forgotten it, um, and you want to go ahead and master reset the phone. Just waiting for it to complete shutting down. Here we go. Okay. So, here on the left side of the phone are the volume up and down keys. You need to hold down the volume down, and then we're going to simultaneously hold in the power key on the top here. And what will happen is a screen pops up, and you can let go now, and it has a few options. It says here, Fast Boot, Recovery, Factory Reset. Now using the arrow keys as up down arrows for the volume, we're going to press down twice. You're going to highlight where it says here in red, factory reset. And then you use the power key to select that option. Now the phone vibrates, it says HTC on the screen, and then it's going to go ahead and go through the hard master reset procedures. So again, that is how simple it is to reset your phone with the hardware keys on an HTC T-Mobile G2. And while we wait for the reset to complete, let me tell you a little bit about our company and what we do. Basically, worldwide, there's about 500 million retired cell phones. Most of those are sitting in a drawer somewhere collecting dust, and what ultimately happens is that they wind up in landfills. Cell phones have toxic chemicals in them, some of which are lead, arsenic, nickel, um, definitely stuff we don't want in our groundwater. So what we do is we provide people with unused phones the ability to recycle them. We have some mail-in programs, we can do fundraisers, we support several great causes, so we'd love for you to, to visit us at CellSeattle.com. And here we are back at the G2 screen. And in one more moment, we should be all the way back to the main menu where we can go ahead and register the phone again as a new user. To use a G2, you do need to have a Google account. If you don't have one, you can create one during the initial setup process. Um, but this type of reset does erase all personalization. So if you had any photos, um, your email, text messages, things like that, they may get completely erased during this reset. And we're just one step away from being done here. Now just because we're called Cell Seattle doesn't mean that we don't service people outside of Seattle. So if you've stumbled upon our website, um, you found us on YouTube, and you have a cell phone that you want to recycle, don't be discouraged to contact us, please. Alright, here we are back at the main screen. We just need to agree to a couple of prompts, and then we will have access to the phone once again, though it was pattern locked. So we hope that you found this video helpful. We appreciate you tuning in, and we hope to see you again soon. Have a great day.